Hi, this is Dominique Finney and I'm with the National Herbalist Association of Australia at the Sydney Seminar Series. And I have Doretta Robleska with me, who is an absolutely unique practitioner. I'm really impressed with your work. Welcome, Doretta. Thank you. It's wonderful to be here. It's been a very, very interesting day today. So thank you to the National Herbalist Association for the whole day and beautiful speakers. I've thoroughly enjoyed the day today. That's brilliant. Um, you work with a real inner city profile of people in Randwick. I do, yes. Since I'm um, placed in eastern suburbs, there's a number of terribly stressed out corporate, I'll call them corporate women, who are all running on the adrenal energy. And we are living in an extremely um, difficult environment because not only that these women are um, trying to conceive. So what I actually uh, specialize in is a women's health. So I'm helping these women uh, conceive and regulate the menstrual cycle um, because stress unfortunately affects this to a, a great extent mm. and um, women come to see me uh, because they either not ovulating or they're having problems with endometrial lining and obviously stress has got a huge impact on our progesterone production so I use these beautiful herbs that uh, um, are absolutely wonderful in treating all those conditions. Mm, fantastic. And what are um, all your favourite herbs? Well, Chase Tree is the first one that comes to mind, um, which is a, a wonderful uh, menstrual cycle regulator and it uh, supports the luteal phase. I also use uh, Wadiem, Ladies Mentful, beautiful Donquail, uh, Donquay. So there are a, a, ray, a plethora of beautiful herbs that we have at our dispensary to um, stop those women from running into IVF clinics and um, create a, a, a new um, life in a very artificial environment. Right. So um, if somebody wants to get pregnant and they're in that situation, I gather there'll be women who are sort of elderly, over 40, who are coming to you? Absolutely. Well, mm. it ranges. I think any woman from over 30, 35, it's actually experiencing some issues with fertility because the fertility unfortunately does decline after age of 30, I guess. Mm. So I do tend to see a lot of women in that age group, so over 35 plus, and it's not, not unusual to see a woman over 40. Mm. Uh, often these women had um, left uh, uh, fertility as a, a, you know, because they're so busy climbing the corporate ladder that they haven't got the time for um, issues like trying to fall pregnant. And it's, it's actually left as a very last kind of thing on their list to do. And when they come to me, it's kind of like almost too late. But again, given our beautiful Hebel dispensary, it's all quite possible still. Mm. What would you recommend to somebody to do if they wanted to get pregnant? Wow, well, there's a... <laughs> array of uh, issues and things that we could recommend. I mean, obviously, there's a lot of lifestyle factors. There's a lot of nutritional deficiencies. Mm. And as I said, I use herbs to um, uh, promote uh, endometrial thickness mm. and to help um, to, to, to help women to control cortisol. So again, I use a lot of um, a beautiful adaptogens and tonifying mm. herbs to uh, work with our nervous system, which plays a huge role in this whole environment. Great, fantastic. And um, if menopausal women, do you deal with that as well? Yes, well, I'm going through menopause myself, so yeah. I have been using herbs mm. and I'm definitely not interested in going on any uh, hormone replacement therapies because I think, again, our, our herbs do offer us uh, this beautiful phytoestrogenic effects that uh, women can take instead of uh, using the drug treatments. Excellent. Now, how do people get hold of you? Um, I'm uh, on the website www.solutionstohealth.com.au. So yeah. you can simple, simple Google me or Google Naturopathic Randwick and you'll find me. That's lovely. Thank you, Dorota, for your time. Thank you.